Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Ellie and I do mainly fashion related videos. So in today's video, I decided to share with you guys what I wore in Paris. I'm going to be showing you most of the outfits that I wore in Paris. I decided that this would be a good idea so I can give you guys some summer outfit inspiration. And of course, make sure to follow me on Instagram as well for additional outfit ideas. Before we move on to the actual outfits, I wanted to share with you guys that Vavaya have sent me some of their shoes and I'm really excited about this. I have been following the brand for a while on Instagram and I have also watched quite a few review videos on them. So I was definitely really excited when they reached out to me. So let's just talk about the brand in general. So Vavaya is a sustainable footwear brand and they actually make all of their shoes out of recycled materials and they use a special 3D technology in order to achieve the look of the shoe that I'm going to be showing you in a tiny bit and actually each pair of shoes is made out of six recycled bottles from City Waste and the Ocean that is purely amazing and I was super excited to finally see their shoes in real life also before I forget to mention the box is actually made out of 100% uh, recycled uh, cardboard as well so you don't have to worry about that in case uh, this is something that is very important to you so let's just open them up and I wanted to say that I have actually worn the beige ones already and I did wear them in Paris as well you will see them in one of my outfits so these are the square toe Margot flats in the color almond and of course as you know I wear these type of colors all the time so this is literally the most perfect color for me so these shoes are extremely comfortable I was actually worried when I ordered them because with some ballet flats that I've had before they have been quite uncomfortable I have to say so I was really scared that it's gonna be the same uh, case scenario with these but these are actually extremely comfy and they're extremely flexible you can see you can literally bend them over entirely and they're just back to their normal shape so the good thing about these shoes is that they already have some heel padding that really helps with uh, the comfort and also the insole is extremely comfortable it provides really good arch support these flats are machine washable which is purely incredible because with any type of light colored shoes like these this is the best option that you can have. I have worn these a few times already and they don't have any signs of wear and tear for the moment. Uh, so I haven't uh, actually washed them, of course, not yet. But I will definitely update you in the future when I actually uh, wash them. And I'll probably share that on my Instagram stories or somewhere in a YouTube video, of course. So if you're interested, you can always message me to ask me for an update on these. And for the moment, I have just uh, only cleaned the uh, sole, of course. This is the other color that I have chosen. It is the denim blue shade. And I love this color. As you guys probably already know, I don't incorporate too much color into my wardrobe. But this particular denim blue color is absolutely perfect for my style. It goes so well with all of my neutral outfits. And the colors that I usually go for are either navy or baby blue or green. I really like wearing sage and uh, dark green. So those are the colors that I like the most. So when it comes to sizing, just by looking at the size chart, I did end up sizing up in these. And uh, I would say that they're a tiny bit big. So I am planning on returning the denim blue ones and I am just going to go for half a size up instead of uh, a whole size up. I will still wear my beige ones because they do fit. I do feel comfortable in them, but I really just want to try out just half a size up and see if they would fit even better. They do have a 45 day exchange or return policy and they do ship worldwide. Also, when you go to the side, you'll be able to see that the Margot flats have a white feet option. So you can order them, especially for white feet. And you can see all of the measurements in the site and um, compare just the normal uh, Margot flats to the white feet ones and uh, see which would be better for you. Keep in mind that with any of the outfits that I'm going to be showing you now, uh, I would say that the... 
uh, margot flats in the color almond would be perfect with pretty much any of them because all of them are extremely neutral and uh, the beige color really suits all of my outfits so we're gonna start off with the outfit that I have actually traveled in so it consists of uh, this cream and black tank top and I have combined this tank top with a shearling jacket and on the shearling jacket I have actually added a brooch you can see a uh, flower brooch i really like adding this brooch to many different outerwear pieces you'll be able to see this outfit a little bit better on uh, the photos and videos that i'm gonna be showing you guys and i have once again added my favorite cream denim maxi skirt this outfit is very much my style i wasn't sure exactly how hot it would be in paris so i really wanted to have a few outerwear pieces with me so this jacket was uh, perfect it was actually a bit too uh, warm for that jacket most of the time but overall it was definitely better to have an outerwear piece because sometimes i would just put it over my shoulders just to have a little bit of warmth especially at night time i feel like it's always good to have some sort of outerwear piece and if it's extremely hot you can just go for a linen shirt and uh skip any type of uh jackets so with that particular outfit i did wear just some neutral colored sneakers and the bag that i wore with that outfit was my Loewe basket bag which has been one of my go-to bags uh, recently. I have been wearing this bag so much and you're gonna see it incorporated in a lot of the outfits um, throughout this video. So it's definitely a great spring summer bag and you can even wear it early fall. I feel like it's a very, very versatile bag, easy to style. So it was definitely a great purchase. One of my favorite outfits that I wore in Paris was a head to toe linen look. I wore a white linen vest that is currently on this hanger and then a white uh, linen blazer and also white linen trousers and it was such a great look. I have combined this look with my adidas uh, sambas or adidas sambas and uh, it turned out great in my opinion. And also I did put over my shoulders a striped top. That particular top is currently in the wash but I recently bought a very similar one because I have been wearing the other one all of the time and uh, this particular one is just a little bit different because the other one is a little bit more of a white with black and this is more of a cream with black as you guys know i wear a lot of different cream tones and white in general so it's really good to have uh kind of different tones of uh, white off white in uh, my wardrobe with this outfit i wore my saint laurent mini toy shopping bag which is extremely comfortable uh, by comfortable i mean i don't really have to think about my handbag at all it is uh not too big i wear it crossbody and it's just such a good uh handbag so i'm very happy with this purchase as well i'm definitely planning on wearing the same old linen look combined with my Loewe basket bag uh, instead and with my uh, flats in the almond color i feel like that would be such a great uh, outfit so i really do look forward to uh, doing this exact fit as well in the future another piece that i wore a lot in paris were my black linen shorts they're extremely easy to style i did wear them a lot with my black sweetheart neckline tank top and uh, I have combined them on different days with uh, different outerwear pieces. So one of the days I wore this uh, beige uh, oversized blazer with uh, some really nice shoulder pads. Uh, this is definitely one of my all-time favorite blazers. I have worn this um, for years now. I've had it in my wardrobe for years and it is extremely easy to style even in the summer it's not uh, too thick so you wouldn't feel too warm with it so it is absolutely perfect i really enjoyed uh, combining this uh, particular blazer with the beige flats you'll be able to see this combination somewhere on the screen and one of the other days i wore the absolute same like base layer so the same uh, black linen shorts 
just combined with a black tank top and then combined with um, this uh, striped cardigan i really like cardigans in general for summer they're very versatile you can wear them unbuttoned of course buttoned and also over your shoulders and i just remembered that one of the days i actually wore a short sleeve uh linen shirt underneath that beige blazer that i showed you uh, that was also a really nice combination instead of the uh, black tank top i wore this amazing cream vest and i do have the full-on suit but I decided to kind of mix it up this time. So I did just combine it with my favorite cream denim jeans. So these jeans along with my cream denim maxi skirt have been such a go-to uh, pieces of mine. They are so, so good. They go so well with all of my clothing items. And if you don't have already any cream denim uh, items in your wardrobe, I would definitely recommend you guys to add some because they are so good for summer especially. So on that particular day, it wasn't extremely hot. So I was able to get my uh, striped uh, sweater with me and I was just wearing it over my shoulders and the other thing that I also wore at some point uh, throughout the day was this short trench coat which I am super happy about it's quite a recent purchase I have been looking at the Arquette one that is very popular on Instagram but I ended up finding this one and I really like the overall design the color is absolutely perfect it's not too long but it's not too short as i do have a cropped trench coat that i'm gonna show you in a little bit uh, that is truly very cropped but uh, this one is just kind of a mid-length i guess i am really glad that i added this trench coat into my collection i do like all of my trench coats and uh, i just use them for uh, kind of different occasions another outfit that i really enjoyed was uh, this full-on pinstripe uh, suit look and this pinstripe suit in general is one of my most worn um, suits I feel like of all time I have worn this so so much it's good for almost any season it's not too thick it's just such a great item to have in your wardrobe especially on days on which you're not sure what to wear having those type of suits is just ideal so on that particular day I did end up getting my cropped uh, trench coat with me throughout the day and I did actually wear it for quite a few hours in the morning when it was a bit colder still but at some point it uh, was way too hot so I was just wearing my pinstripe suit and I really like both looks uh, I really like layering this uh, trench coat in general with a pinstripe uh, suit so the last outfit that I wanted to share with you guys is a full-on linen uh, look again but uh this particular linen set i bought from paris actually i will be sharing a little bit more about uh, the brand in general and where i bought it from in my next video because i will be doing a whole video uh very soon so um yeah i'm gonna be sharing some more information uh about this set in that particular video but yes this is a very versatile set once again because i can wear uh, these two pieces on their own but i can obviously always wear them as a full-on set especially on days when i'm not sure what to wear i really like uh sets like these because they are just extremely easy to throw on and you're ready to go you look stylish and it's all very easy with these type of uh, linen sets for summer i'm gonna stop myself here so i don't overwhelm you guys with uh 10 million more outfits so i just wanted to share which were the accessories that i brought with me so i did pack with me both of my cinnamon belts these belts are purely essential for me i have more belts in my collection but i have to say that the cinnamon belts are the ones that i wear the most and they always look so stylish with all of my outfits i would say that they elevate all of my outfits they're very simple very stylish that's why those were the only two belts that i brought with me for uh this vacation and when it comes to bags these were my main two bags that i brought with me i actually did get two more little bags that were quite easy to carry uh in the luggage but I didn't wear them as much so i would say that these were my two main bags for the vacation that was all for this video guys make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel so you don't miss any of my future videos 
the next video that i will be filming will be a haul video i am really excited about this particular haul video because it will include so many different linen items and i'm just really excited to share them with you guys so definitely make sure to subscribe to my channel turn on your notifications and also don't forget to follow me on instagram for more outfit inspiration you will definitely be able to see more outfits with my new flats there i'm definitely going to be uploading a lot more throughout uh, the summer thank you very much for watching this video and see you in the next one bye